Monsieur de Louis Mayabura, author of the book titled Gangster State Unraveling AC Magashuli's Web of Capture, has challenged the ANC Secretary General, AC Magashuli, to sue him. He says that the optimist in him hopes to see the former Free State Premier in an orange uniform in prison. Mayabura has been addressing an audience of around 100 people at Urban Lime in central Dubburn on Tuesday night of the 21st of May 2019, and he says that considering the amount of time that Magashuli had to roll out his alleged looting network in the Free State, and considering the length of his political career, which was problematic from the get-go, it was apt to unpack it in book format. Unlike in Gawalting, where the launch was disrupted last month, and in the Free State, where the book's launch at the University of the Free State was cancelled last week, amid fears of possible disruption, the Dubburn launch proceeded without a glitch. With Magashuli recently saying that he would prove in court that Mayabura was a liar, the author says that he is unfazed and that he is actually inviting Magashuli to sue him for defamation. In the last 10 years, corruption issues have not ended up in court when prominent people were involved because of the capture of the environment of government and if it takes a defamation suit to finally get a corrupt individual in court by all means, please sue myself and the publisher. He's been making those utterances for a month now and I'm really becoming concerned about his legal bill because he's saying he's in consultation with his lawyers and we all know what lawyers charge, so it's going to be quite a hefty bill, says Mayabura. He says that his book was written in such a way as to allow the reader to come on this journey as I unpack and reconstruct A.C. Magashuli, the criminal and state capturer. While working on the 360-page book, Mayabura says that he had been on Magashuli's trail for 13 months, doing full-time research on the former Premier of the Free State Province, and says that in this period, he discovered that Magashuli operated like a brazen gangster, likening him to the character of Harlem drug boss, Frank Lucas, in the blockbusting 2007 movie, American Gangster. Another thing that I started realizing about Magashuli is that he quite literally does operate like a gangster frequently in his dealings with contractors, fellow politicians, and other people who operate in this political economic sphere where government tenders are decided upon. That includes things like literally working with something like a burner phone that he uses a couple of times to ensure that there couldn't be any criminal investigation to trace these type of things, Mayabura says. He says that people who had the front row seat of Magashuli's handling of the Free State Province coffers and the way he ran that province's administration in his close to a decade long tenure as its premier have said that the book's title was too soft on the now NC Secretary General. He says that he had originally set out to look at certain case studies and in this instance those were naturally government tenders and he found that corrupt deals around tenders do allow people to build a detailed picture of how an individual like Magashuli, who functioned as a state capturer, functioned in this capacity. It is always a band of contractors, closely associated with Magashuli, the likes of his daughter, his brother in some instances, the family members of high-profile politicians in the province, associates of and political backers of Magashuli, who walk away with these contracts. It is also to ensure that there is continued money flows to people in this network of benefactors of state contracts. The laws and regulations that govern how the government spends money in South Africa is flouty time and again. You've got things like the Municipal Public Finance Management Act that has sidestepped to ensure that people like Magashuli's associates get the contacts, says Mayabura. Please check in the description box below for the links to the sources of this report. Thanks for watching. Please comment, like, share and subscribe.